I would like to take this opportunity and to express uh, my uh, my great uh, uh, the appreciation and to the uh, head of uh, the Trace Foundation, Andrea. Um, over the past uh, uh, many years, uh, the Trans Foundation did a, a remarkable uh, job in Tibet in terms of uh, preserving the Tibetan culture and help Tibetans to uh, uh, develop uh, the economical, um, uh, the ec economically and. Uh, as well as well as education and the uh, environment uh, and the other the issues and the other areas as well. And I personally uh, must to, to point out that uh, uh, there is no any other uh, single non-profit uh, organization uh, such as Trace and uh, uh, did anything can be compared to uh, the what Trace did so far in Tibet. Um, so Trace did the, the, the job, which you can see by uh, your own eyes, even you can touch by your own hands. So therefore, and, uh, uh, Trace has been a uh, model and uh, also a bit the uh, mentor. Uh, it's, uh, it's great uh, uh, organization in Tibet. I feel that if we have uh, the, the one organization like this one can make uh, such an influence, and uh, uh, that is a uh, greater contribution and uh, Trace uh, contributed to Tibet. Uh, this afternoon, the topic I'm going to discuss is uh, related to the, the entire uh, humanity or the mankind on the earth. Uh, Regardless uh, the West, uh, people in the West or people uh, from the East, either you are Tibetan or you are Chinese or you are Americans, uh, one thing is quite uh, is, uh, absolutely common, and that is uh, everybody seeking for the happiness and try to avoid the suffering. However, the definition of a happiness and uh, the approach or the method, methodology and, uh, by which uh, to achieve the happiness due to the differences of culture and the uh, uh, living environment, and it comes uh, uh, the, 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 uh, and they understand the, the differently. Again, this afternoon, uh, I'm going to focus on the, the philosophical view uh, in, uh, uh, with regard to the happiness and, uh, and the, uh, the, the method and, uh, by which uh, to achieve the happiness. Uh, 
that has been transformed uh, or passed down by the Tibetan ancestor. And so I'm going to discuss about uh, what they have invented, um, how they explain about the happiness, and the causes of happiness, and the path lead to the happiness, and their philosophical view, and uh, their practice, and also the result uh, uh, they have achieved. I have prepared a great deal of uh, amount of uh, uh, the things uh, I want to discuss this afternoon, but because of time, and I'm going to keep the, all those away, and uh, rather I like to share three stories with you. Um, because I feel if we talk about uh, uh, Tibet or the land of Tibet, the people of Tibet, and the culture of Tibet, and uh, these uh, three topics, and, and uh, uh, probably uh, most of you even know better than I do, so therefore I'm not going to focus on that. Uh, the first story I'm going to share with you is about myself. Uh, the place I was born, and as you can see on the screen. Uh, this place is called Doi, uh, is in, uh, located in Ando uh, province, uh, Tibet. And uh, this uh, place uh, was uh, is the birthplace of uh, the 10th Panchen Lama. And uh, also the uh, very uh, well-known and eminent uh, uh, the Buddhist uh, master uh, Geshe uh, Shere Jamso was uh, also was born in this place. I was born in 1959. When I was born, and uh, best from what I remember is that I was an uh, old lady, uh, she lived, uh, she was in, in her 95 years uh, old, in the age of 95, uh, but she was uh, my grandma. Uh, uh, up to age five, and I was uh, 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 rest and uh, uh, even shared the bed time with my grandma. And uh, during that time, and she uh, told me a lot of stories. And uh, uh, through that, the, uh, the, those stories, and uh, I uh, subconsciously de develop the, the concepts of uh, Tibet and, 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 uh, and the values of Tibet culture. Um, when my grandma, when she was uh, passed away, and uh, while well, on the process of dying, and uh, she was uh, so happy, and it, it, she uh, showed uh, the great and, and uh, uh, the expressed and, and uh, great uh, uh, happiness and the contentment, and uh, she, she even uh, proclaimed, said, "Look, there is a milk stream that fell down uh, and, uh, above uh, 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 up the sky, and uh, come on and uh, make the offerings." You know, she also took the uh, drop of uh, milk and. Uh, uh, they uh, sp uh, sprinkled up and then uh, upwards and uh, uh, made an offerings. Uh, her simple practice is that in the daily, uh, day to day life, uh, that uh, whenever she has, uh, before she consumes the meal, and uh, one thing she uh, definitely will do is uh, make an uh, offering, the blessings and the food. And uh, uh, even though uh, she never uh, uh, attends school and uh, uh, don't know how to, doesn't know how to read and write in, um, but uh, her prayer and her basic attitude and our uh, understanding life is uh, always uh, talking and thinking about the all sentient beings and the benefits of all sentient beings. 
Well, she told me is that when she was young, a little, a little girl, and uh, this the mountain and the uh, peak of the mountain, which you can see on screen, was covered by forest. And uh, uh, of course, I was born, but uh, I was raised and grew up uh, until age 18, and I spent my life in this town. In this valley, um, they were uh, also covered, uh, 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 covered by the forest, and uh, there's uh, lots of uh, natural and uh, the uh, springs, uh, water springs uh, was flowing. Uh, six years later, and uh, uh, last year, I went to uh, you know, my hometown, and what I find is uh, uh, the forest, which I, and, uh, was covered in uh, uh, the valley, uh, the, uh, the, in my village, was gone, and uh, the rivers are uh, also, and, uh, uh, the numbers of rivers are, river, the stream uh, dramatically reduced. From hundred, over hundreds, and now become about five to between five to ten. Hmm. Just in the night, short time, just in the night, ah, ah, the sea took a long time. Ah, ah, the sea don't look cheap. So, the day don't do well. You know, short time. The Buddhist tuba, ah, uh, short time tuba, which you see, ah, um, it, uh, uh, it has a story and uh, uh, about uh, the one of the eminent master. Uh, the reincarnated Lama, uh, Allah Shadon Rambuche. And uh, we built up this uh, stuba in 2002, but before we built up this stuba, and uh, there were and uh, three times uh, uh, they tried to plant the trees uh, in this area, but uh, all those three times and then uh, when the tree grow up, uh, grow up, then cut it uh, off. Um, so three times and then not, not, uh, never left the tree there. I took this picture in two thousand two. And I believe today, if I go back and took a, uh, take another picture, probably there are lots of trees there around. Um, today, local Tibetans live in this area. Um, they go there and plant tree voluntarily on a voluntary basis, and even they uh, plant uh, the flowers and. Um, uh, the, the lots of trees uh, because uh, they think uh, this is a stupa <coughs> and uh, it's an uh, object of uh, uh, worship. Here I would like uh, to make an announcement. My announcement is basically uh, is about a conclusion which I drawn based on my experience. I believe that in Tibet, and, uh, uh, the pureness of uh, the land of Tibet and the, the pureness of uh, the water and uh, the, the pureness of uh, uh, the uh, air, um, if that's something and, and, and it is left in Tibet and had ever existed in Tibet, is the result of the, the purity or the, pure, uh, uh, the, the pureness of the Tibetan culture. 
I believe that the, the Tibetan culture is a something it's a, 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 a very kind and a, 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 and owned a great deal of kindness to the mankind. Um, because the origin of uh, the uh, the great rivers and uh, such as uh, Yellow River and the Yangtze River and uh, the w other rivers that flow from Tibet into India, all of them are originated in Tibet. The source of uh, those rivers and the snowy mountains, all of them are originated in Tibet, located in Tibet. According to the Chinese government statistic, uh, it, it, it uh, shows that uh, in Tibet and there are over 210 different kind of uh, species uh, uh, that make home in Tibet. Um, uh, the, yes, the animals, uh, the mammals, sorry. So, uh, if you ask uh, 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 what uh, made this and uh, uh, how come this is the, the uh, reality, I must say this is a, a result of the practice of Tibetan culture. Um, so those who uh, hold the lineages uh, or the traditions of Tibetan culture or the passed down and uh, the, the Tibetan culture, uh, of course uh, the, uh, the eminent, uh, the numberless, countless number of uh, uh, the great uh, scholars and masters and uh, um, I, that's a, I won't. I will not uh, uh, count on uh, all of them by name. But uh, here, I would like to point out one uh, remarkable, remarkable, and the most influential figure as Lama Tsongkhapa. Tatikola, tag kungo songso chongwe pasi yokera. Tandi ngaranga lechi ngaranga de alo shadong buche zile. Ah, de Lama Jinda de tangi wok de jiru buche ga lanen chimu de lem mangbu shiga tani tesam shini. Um, the Lama Tsongkhapa, throughout his lifetime, uh, he composed uh, many uh, volumes, uh, 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 the, uh, different volumes of literature, and uh, uh, I, I wouldn't uh, uh, go over all of them, but I would like to point out one thing, that uh, this textbook, which I'm holding, uh, is uh, the result of uh, uh, the, his uh, uh, teaching, and then the, his teaching of uh, the great treatise uh, on the part, uh, a stages of part to the enlightenment. Oh yeah. I, I, sorry, go on there. I learned uh, and then uh, these uh, uh, treatises, uh, the great treatises uh, on the uh, uh, stages of the path to the enlightenment uh, from reincarnated Lama Alo Shadong Rinpoche. Kongo Kendani Ngi Lam Rinpoche Tani Nga Di Nga Rinpoche Jang Yuga Nang Tung Tui Na and I have uh, taken uh, so many classes uh, uh, from Allah uh, Shadon um, the based on his uh, uh teaching and uh, the part the, the, uh, the treatises of uh, uh, the path on the uh, stages of the path to the, to the enlightenment and however having said that uh, my own uh, the field of study is uh, mathematics Oh yeah, that is Kungu Kundani Nyandu Te Tenga Jima in a Swedeni Sustainable Development Education. That is the Hojong Zendala Nga Lang Tag Rini Shishipai. So the Nyanunjus for the other. Nay, Jangu Te, Jangu Kwari, the name is Hosu Nagari. Uh, 
So I studied uh, uh, studied and taught uh, math math uh, math uh, uh, as a uh, uh, profession, and uh, but I had an opportunity um, well, attend uh, the two meetings in two occasions, and uh, I attended the conference in Sweden, and uh, the meetings are basically uh, about uh, the sustainable education development. And this is my second time in America. After my second uh, first trip in uh, Sweden and uh, then second time in uh, America, uh, what I really uh, 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 learned uh, from these uh, uh, trips and uh, is that uh, oh, whatever the world people today are looking for, the sol the solutions they're looking for, and uh, the path that they are uh, wondering about. And actually, is uh, has been taught by Lama Tsongkhapa, and the, the message or the uh, methodology has been delivered through the, his uh, uh, teaching of uh, the path on the uh, the stages of uh, path that uh, lead uh, to the enlightenment. Oh yeah, ta ye Lama Tsongkhapa chimbu ko tanu nu ko dini divan ruvi lankara ti lanti chetan ruvi chha rambati ta do jina ta ko jiva singa lan. So, whether the Lama Tsongkhapa, the, his methodology, the, the, the solution, and he showed it to the world people today, is that uh, you know, what the ha uh, happiness is, and uh, how you can um, at, obtain the happiness, but then uh, at the further to, uh, to enhance the, the happiness, and the, the method being given, and uh, the, the structures being uh, taught in these uh, uh, treatises um, through the notions of uh, three and uh, per, uh, uh, different individuals is generally called uh, the three persons uh, uh, or three uh, scopes. Mm -hmm.